Hey, this is just a quick one to point out that on May the 7th, two days ago, Incas version 6.1 was released. And I think when it comes down to it, a lot of the home labbers might be interested in the point releases. If you're running at a company though, you probably want to stick back at Incas version 6.0 because it's the LTS version. In any case, 6.1 was released on May the 7th and it has a few interesting features here. Uh, to begin with, uh, Stefan credits students at the University of Texas at Austin for providing a number of these new features. And he also goes on to say, expect a lot more features when 6.2 arrives. So right now in looking down the feature list, he says that he now supports the creation of complex ZFS pools. And mainly, it sounds like you can have ZFS pools that are striped, mirrored, RAID 5, or RAID 6. And I think from what I'm seeing here, that it might support that in Incas Admin Init. If not, it certainly supports them after you have created your uh, initial pool. And then he has some uh, support of listing profiles across projects. Of course, I haven't really mentioned projects. Projects are for project management to keep containers isolated to a particular group of people. And um, <clears throat> then he has here uh, API level support for that uh, all projects key. And then we have additional functions uh, for this uh, placement scriptlet. Not sure exactly what that involves. And then there's a whole series of commands that have supported uh, YAML. And now he's trying to produce command symmetry across the entire group of commands. And so he lists a group of commands here where he's achieving that. And then uh, he also says that there are going to be <clears throat> what they call customizable commands. And then uh, also they're going to have a uh, stateful migration for containers. And then uh, he's talking about ACLs for Open Virtual Network, OVN. Uh, in an upcoming video, I just mentioned OVN in passing because I'm talking about clusters and OVN is one of the things that uh, you can use to do load balancing in clusters. And then uh, he has uh, instance uptime tracking, which sounds like it's really going to be super fantastic. And then uh, improvement to uh, network handling during uh, cluster evacuations. And that's pretty much it. But I just wanted to stop by real quick and uh, just point out that we've got a new version of Incas version 6.1.